Hi everyone, I wanted to give folks a virtual site visit. Today's July 1st, it's around 4 p.m. We're of course down here at the pump house, looking out at the river reach just upstream and along the edge of Meander A. A little difficult to appreciate here, uh, the vertical uh, relief associated with the river surface here and the drop down to the meander B and C. Uh, it's really incredible. So the gradient for flow across these meanders right now is just extreme. Alex Newman was just sampling out uh, at the measurement locations for Carolyn Anderson and Marco Kyloite from the University of Massachusetts and noted to me today that it was just about the deepest he's seen it walking along on the floodplain surface. So we've got the dogs here. One's about to get yelled at because he does not need to go in that water. But I did want to give folks uh, an appreciation for just how much water we're seeing this year. Not only was it a high snowpack year, as we've already alluded to, but we had a really suppressed melt because May was, uh, was quite unseasonably cool. Um, now we're getting pulled away by the dogs. Um, but what I do want to really emphasize is that um, this snow melt has really come off, particularly the highest elevations. Uh, if you look up there, you can see that uh, still a bit of snow remaining. Certainly when you fly over it in the air, you can see the highest elevations, definitely still snow to come off. Uh, we've had very hot weather over the past uh, week to week and a half, and boy, is it coming. While we may have already missed the absolute peak, we've seen a rapid increase in our discharge profiles at our monitoring locations, uh, both in the upper areas of the East River, as well as downstream at the USGS gauging stations. Um, that increase has come up, uh, may again reach that max discharge point. But again, as far as the floodplain and floodplain inundation is concerned, well, just to give you an example, uh, there's some of the flotsam that's accumulated through these um, larger pushes of water uh, as discharge comes out um, over the course of each day.